welcome to my quick comparative review of the True Scale, True Scale Models TSM uh, Mini GT cars. These are all R35 Nissan GTRs, and um, <coughs> these two are Pandems with Rocket Bunny Aero kits, wide body, and these two are Liberty Walk with the uh, typical Li Liberty Walk um, style wide body kit. So um, these ones, it's more of a what I would call a blistered arch, like the Audi Quattro made famous in the 80s. Whereas these ones are a more, even more retro arch, something you'd really consider the shape of that from the 70s potentially, but bigger and bolder in this iteration. Um, now, look, let's look at the wheels. Um, both of the Pandems have BBS deep dish alloys with the silver rims and the um, the gold centers. I really like that. Um, really like that. I find these wheels are a bit over the top in the red. Uh, are they five hole wheels? Yes, basically speaking, five hole wheels. A bit like uh, maybe an Alfa Romeo. Um, whereas on this one here, you've got. Uh, multi-spoke Y-spoke wheels, if I count that, that's going to be, mm -hmm. they're triple Y's perhaps, yeah, a bit weird, maybe seven spoke or seven dual spoke, hard to see because they're black and dark, right, now, I don't know what you think, but we've got three metallic cars here, let's look at the two red ones together, right, I'm going for the Pandem again in terms of the red colour there, the lava red. Um, whereas the Liberty Walk one is considered to be candy red. Okay, it's a bit brighter, bolder, uh, a bit more custom car. Whereas this, you could get away with it being a pretty much a standard colour on a production car. Um, but then, of course, with the Liberty Walk, you've got the option of the uh, the white one with the carbon bonnet and in fact this bonnet has the most vents of any of the bonnets of these models um, if we look at the Liberty Walk and the Pandem the other Liberty Walk and the Pandems they're basically the same bonnets bulges with little vents on I don't know I'm not necessarily a fan of different colour bonnets it's very 70s rally to me, um, which is fine, but um, not sure it's my thing. Um, then we've got the question of the rear wings. Let's line up the rear wings. So we've got a, a low mount Liberty Walk wing. The Pandem cars both have the same rear wing. So the Big difference is the you've got the top mount Liberty Walk and you've got the low mount Liberty Walk against what you know a more conventional bottom mount boot lid mounted rear wings on the Pandems. I think these are better looking wings, but these are more daring and stunning because you're going that bit further with the top mounts or the or the mounting straight into the monocoque. So, how outrageous do you want to be? I think the Pandem cars in general are a little bit more subtle, a bit prettier, whereas the Liberty Walk cars are perhaps a bit more aggressive, a bit more outrageous. Uh, with this one, with the rising sun, you've got a bit more Japanese style, and on the roof there, and with the, the wording on the um, on the rear screens, um, whereas the Pandems, the only window words are the just the Pandem on the top, that on the side. Yeah, definitely much more subtle. Um, personally, this is my favourite. Tell me your favourite. Was it one of the Liberty Walks? In which colour? One of the Pandems? In which colour? Okay, thanks for watching. Do see my other videos of these cars and um, do check out buy now search if you into using eBay 
and you want to find fixed price items quickly before someone else snaps them up. Okay, do subscribe and like this video and thank you very much for watching.